Dave Franco describes Drive in Hollywood premiere for the rental as a little weird to view the full article. Click the first link in the description below. Dave Franco, along with the rest of Hollywood, is quickly transitioning from traditional ways of doing things into more socially distanced methods of performing formal tasks, and the actor and first time director said the drive in premiere for his debut film was perfect, albeit a little weird. Amid the ongoing coronavirus pandemic, Franco, 35, elected to press forward with his film premiere for the rental on Thursday and held the advanced screening at the Vineland Drive-In Theater in Southern California with more than 1,300 people on hand. Along with wife and superstar actress Alison Brie, Franco was also joined by Dan Stevens and Sheila Van. He took off his mask to pose for photographers in the center of a massive parking lot, then answered questions via Zoom from his car after the film ended. Unsubscribe is a zero budget movie that cleverly topped the U.S. box office seat beat a traditional, more buttoned-up red carpet event, Franco said. It didn't feel like there was a spotlight on me or the cast. It felt more like this communal experience where everyone was just excited to get out of their homes and, you know, let loose with a group of fellow movie lovers. It was perfect, he said in an interview Friday. No Time to Die release date moved up, could cost film box office records.